What up, y'all? It's your man, Mizzy Man, Scoop Cat County, YouTube representing the birds. Carson Wentz is a problem. Making mistakes, throwing interceptions, taking sacks, missing throws. Yes, Carson Wentz is a problem. But I believe Carson Wentz is part of the problem. What do I mean by that? There's a bigger problem than Carson Wentz. There is. Doug Peterson and Howie Rosen and the Eagles organization. That's no excuse on Carson Wentz and his bad decisions. It isn't. It's just the facts. It's just the facts. Howie don't draft well. We could have D.K. Metcalf and Justin Jefferson on our team. Instead, we go for J.J. Osega Whiteside, Andre Dillard. We go Jalen Hurts. All these draft picks that just don't work. They don't work. And you see it. Andre Dillard hurt. J.J. Arcega White side. When's the last time he played a game? When's the last time J.J. played a game? When's the last time you played a game? Exactly. Howie Roseman can't draft even if his life depended on it. And Doug Peterson, I don't know if he got hit by a rock or a brick, but when did you stop running the ball? When did you stop giving your players a chance to succeed? Like, Travis Fuller was first in every category in wide receiver, and then you pulled him away because of Alshon Jeffrey. You, you don't run the ball. You can bring Jordan Howard back all you want. You don't run the ball. You don't help your quarterback out by building his strengths. I mean, did Doug Peterson got a concussion or something? <laughs> I mean, did that man get hit by a rock? You forgot to run the ball? You forgot to run the ball? Because apparently it seems like you forgot. Not to mention the organization cares about Jason Peters, Lane, and Brooks, and Alshon, Deshaun, Zach. All these old veterans, when you got Travis Holcomb, Carson Wentz, Miles Sanders, Dallas Goddard, and you build around those four. But you don't. But you won't. You don't, and you won't. You don't, and you won't. And we all know Howie Rosen ain't going to go nowhere next year. We know. So he's going to have a bad draft. The marriage between Doug and Carson is over. They basically officially signed the divorce papers. The second you benched him. Carson Wentz is a problem, y'all. He is. He is. And he, need, and he needs to be benched just to realize that. But he's part of the problem.
When I saw that Jalen Hurts pick, no disrespect to that guy, but when I saw that pick, I was pissed off. I was. Hope he succeeds this Sunday. But I was pissed off. It's like the Chiefs can't help Patrick Mahomes. Other good organization, the Saints can't help Drew Brees. Like other good organizations help their quarterback. Why can't the Eagles have Carson Wentz? It's like. Does Doug Peterson, I need to know, does Doug Peterson got a concussion? Because how can you forget about running the ball? How? Run the dang ball. How can you forget? It was Miles Sanders last year that helped you. Before he got injured, it was Jordan Howard that helped you. How the hell do you don't know how to run the damn ball? JJ, I said go. JJ, I said go white side. JJ, I said go white side. When's the last time that guy got on the field? When's the last time JJ, I said go white side got on the field? When? Someone tell me, cause I don't know. I don't know. Listen, Carson Wentz is a problem. He is, but he's part of the problem. There's also a Howie Roseman problem. There's also a Ducky P problem. And this offseason, Jeffrey Lurie got a whole lot of problems that needs to be fixed. Because... Jeff Lurie got nine nine problems. But Carson Wentz ain't one. So, again, Carson Wentz is a problem. But he's part of it. And Jeffrey Lurie got some work to do this offseason. season.